Finally, Apple is making good use of lock screen by giving us lot of customization options. Quite similar to Android. Now you can have widgets on iPhone lock screen. It's really good, especially you can see your battery percentage right from the lock screen. There are more widgets like weather, calendar, health, reminders, and so on. When you press and hold your lock screen, it gives you customization options. When you scroll right, you can add a different lock screen by clicking on plus icon. You can choose your photo as your new lock screen or any other photo of your choice. Suppose if you don't like a particular lock screen, you can delete it by swiping it up and clicking on the trash icon. You can also choose weather or even an emoji lock screen or choose from suggested collection. You can also choose different color options as your lock screen. Now this one is very interesting, a cool smiley emoji icon. It really looks cool for a lock screen. You can also add some more emojis like hi or anything of your choice. It really looks quite interesting choice for a lock screen. When you scroll to right, it will zoom a bit with every scroll. And also have this zoom in effect which looks quite amazing. Well, this is my current lock screen. I really find it very simple and stylish. You can also have this alien emoji with different planets and black backdrop. You can also add another emoji of your choice here. Now this kind of unique lock screen we have never seen on an iOS device. I'm really glad Apple is finally bringing something new to the table for iOS in terms of customization. When you press and hold the lock screen, you get option of customize. Click on that and now you can customize your lock screen. When you click on time, you can change the font and color. When you click on date widget, you will get more widget options. Here you can choose favorite type of date and day widget. Tap on just below the time widget, you will see all the new widget options. The battery percentage widget is a must have. Also, I will choose mini weather widget. You can choose any widget of your choice. If you don't like a certain one, you can delete it and assign something else. Here you can scroll up and go on each application for all the widget selection. At the moment, there are few widgets, but I'm sure in the future, you will see plenty of options for lock screen widgets on iOS. So once you are satisfied with your selection, you can click on done and your new lock screen will be saved here. Also something new in lock screen is now you scroll from down to up to see all your notifications, which I feel is more practical and looks great. So in the same way, you can keep making your new lock screen and customize them. So guys, this was all the new changes on iPhone lock screen. If you're wondering why you don't have this feature on your iPhone, it's because this feature is coming soon on iOS 16 update which will roll out to public in September. So just wait for this update and soon you will have this amazing lock screen on your iOS device. If you can't wait for the update, you can download iOS beta profile on your iPhone and start using these new iPhone 16 features on your iPhone. So that's it for this video guys. I really hope you like this video. If you like the video, kindly hit the thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't. See you all soon in my next video. Till then, goodbye, peace and blessings.